It's a beautiful day in this neighborhood A beautiful day for a neighbor Would you be mine? What is going on everybody? Welcome back to the channel Pines Trees, a 21 and over medical cannabis review channel out of the state of Pennsylvania. So today we're going to be in my living room. Um, the YouTube studio is very hot in the summertime. It's actually why I haven't made very many videos lately, but I decided that not making videos isn't really helping anybody and you got to keep it going so we got to make videos this is hank the tank he's my sidekick you haven't seen him in very many videos since the very early early beginning of the channel because he doesn't go up to the third floor my buddy does not like going up steps so this is hank the tank welcome to pines trees uh, about the giveaway, so, haven't done the giveaway, people have been asking, um, I set the rules up pretty straightforward, um, you know, 50 people had to, uh, you know, do the thing on the video, we got to about 20, um, and that was at 350, and we're at, we're almost up to 400 people. And still only about 20 people engaged in that video and the video is the giveaway is for an expensive piece it's for the dab x and a bunch of glass made by me so i wanted it to be worth everybody's while mine especially wanted at least 50 people to engage we got to about 20 we're almost up to 400 subscribers now so if we get to 420 subs before we get to 50 people who say good grief glass on the giveaway video, I'm probably just going to roll it over into the 420 giveaway and hope that at least 50 people engage in that. If not, oh well, you guys will get to see me do a gram dab and it is what it is, right? So let's get on to the get on. What do we got today? We got something that came out of nowhere. Something that was absolutely unforeseen by me or most people, I'm guessing, other than the people that work for this company. But 710 just passed. A lot of people dropped a lot of crazy stuff. Rosin was a big thing. Caviar was a big thing. And then some other companies dropped some other different more you know just more normal to the to the industry to the pa uh market i guess you could say but not common for themselves so kind of caught my attention we got today some some really surprisingly good Double Bear. This is live Double Bear. This is live wax. This stuff, brand new to the market, 65 bucks a gram, live wax. Double Bear. Everybody knows. Double Bear, when it's good, it's really good. When it's not, it's like greenish brown sauce sometimes and you know it can be it can be hit or miss obviously it's it's a lower priced product it's a it's not it's not super high priced so you you know your quality is up and down sometimes to put it nicely so this is live this is the first time i've ever seen live wax they also came out with sugar but I didn't realize when I was at the dispensary that they had the sugar and the wax, so I just asked for the live, and dude just gave me whatever. And we got the coffee ice cream live wax. Uh, I'm not gonna lie, you know how it goes. I've smoked on it for a couple days to get a feel for it, to be able to give you a good review of it, and 
it it surprised it surprised me like a lot a lot like it's a very surprisingly good concentrate for a very low price a lot of other companies have been coming out with lower cost concentrates that have been you know iffy at best uh but this stuff this stuff is this stuff is so good that if you were to scoop this out and put it in a top tier company's jar and hand it to me and say hey man check out this insert company's name here i just picked it up it's live it's this that and the other thing and you were to hand it to me i would believe you like this stuff looks smells and tastes just like some top tier stuff but at a at a great price 65 bucks a gram for live and it's terpy it's got the terps it's got it's it's good so let's get into it let's talk about it let's smoke it and let's let's enjoy a little session because we haven't seshed out in like many weeks i would say like three weeks maybe it's been so let's let's get to session let's smoke some but first let's talk about the info so we got coffee ice cream live wax double bear actually before we get into it check out the new box the new box is like really like look at this it's got the, the gold it's got the really nice logo even on the inside like they stepped it up they stepped it up big time even the inside lip it's got some really good art on it like look at the side of it it's like a fancy purse reminds me of like like a coach purse or a dolce and gabbana bag you know it's got it's just got the designs going wild so they up their game as far as graphic design as far as packaging um new jars these jars are like uh i want to say they're like calypso's jars but i'm not positive it's been a minute but they're these kind of jars where you squeeze and pull square jar look at that color before we even get in it look at the color you see that color zoom in if you have to we're gonna get into it though. I'm gonna throw some close-ups on as always, but let's get into the info. Super surprisingly good, low price stuff. I feel like if this is what's hitting the market, top, like those high price companies, they're gonna have they're gonna have some competition because this stuff is good at a good price. So let's get into it. CBC zero zero CBD zero CBDA zero CBG zero point five nine zero percent CBGA zero point eight nine one percent THCA seventy five point eight five one percent so not a whole lot as far as CBs uh, just THCA um it's not super high like 75 isn't super high but wait till you hear about these terps man wait till you hear about these terps so they only list top three obviously but these top three are extremely impressive and i'd be curious to know what the rest like what the rest make it equal out to because they don't give you a total so we got limonene at 5.489%. It's almost 5.5% limonene. That is crazy. Okay, so straight out of the gate with a whopper. 5.489% limonene. Then you have caryophyllene, 1.348%. Not bad. One Over 1%, one always good. And you have linalool at 1.122%. So 5, 6, 7, 8, 
we're looking at almost 9% terps just with the top three. So I'm gonna go ahead and easily say that this is in the 10% club as far as terps. This is, it's tasty. It smells good, it looks good, it's it's good. Like, it was, it was a super big surprise to me because of the amount of hit or miss I've had with Double Bear. Like, I've had great, great, great Double Bear stuff. Sour Tangy's great usually, sometimes it's not. Coffee ice cream. One of their best strains, one of my favorite. This stuff is like, it's good medicine. For me personally, it's it's one of, you know, it's their best for me, but it's definitely one of the better medications because it hits almost every, every point that I need it to hit, which is like hybrid indica dominant, makes, uh, makes pain melt away, great for depression, makes you hungry, all the things. So like it just, it checks all the boxes for me. So yeah, and it's 65 bucks for a whole gram. Yeah, I'll buy this all day, all day. So let's get down a little and let's take a look. What do you guys think of this fit? What do you guys think? Am I, am I sporting today? Am I? Is it too much? Too much pink? Is, is it too much? I'm sorry. But as far as smell, it's got that. It's got that dank coffee ice cream smell that like if you if you've been in the market and you've smoked coffee ice cream. It's got that really like savory, dank, kind of sweet, but kind of like just really nice on the smell. Um, it looks amazing, if you can see that. Sorry for the lighting, I gotta figure out how to get the lighting in here to be perfect, but I think that's pretty good. But like, it looks, a lot like Pharma RX's wax, like, and that's not a bad thing because they're a top tier company, so it's nice and terpy. It's not even very waxy, I would more or less call it like a butter or a batter. It's definitely not what I would call traditional type wax, um, but yeah, it is saucy it is ah, stinky smells good I got cat hair on my table but yeah it's a good one it, it surprised me it made me happy when I got it um, I'm actually probably gonna smoke this in the puff go eh, we'll go dab X screw it we'll go with the dab X So, the Dab X, for anybody who's been wondering since the first video, it, it's a ripper. It, it works good. Um, actually, just did the the final video of like the true review of the Dab X, and I, I can't find any flaws in it. So if you haven't seen the review, the actual review video of the DabX, go check that out. But it's it's a nice device. It definitely, definitely works. Like way better than you expect it to. So double tap. Let it warm up. We're gonna rip it talk about that flavor
all that limonene right out front, followed by a cushy, clean water taste. And then after that, you get like a little bit of pepper and then just sweet, creamy coffee ice cream taste. It is very true to its name. I do get like a coffee-ish ice cream, like creamy ice cream and a coffee taste from it. It's why it's one of my favorites by them. My honest opinion, like their sour tangy and their coffee ice cream is hands down their best stuff. did it so that's another thing if you're used to doing hits on something where you have to do a second reheat to finish up the dab this doesn't really do that i like to reheat it just to make sure i got all of it but it doesn't require the reheat you're basically getting it all in that first rip unless you pack like a half gram in there then you might need a reheat but like it's very good at uh it's very good at what it does so let's get down to it this stuff it's good it tastes good like i said limonene out front um peppery a little bit of that cushy clean water flavor and then creamy coffee ice cream to finish uh it sticks in your mouth like it's you could tell it's it's a better quality live resin because after the hit you exhale you sit around for a minute or two you can still taste it it stays with you um like i said very dank very like sweet cream but also has like that peppery limonene in it too so it's very it's a very diverse profile as far as flavors but very nice um, as far as effects like I said it's great for pain great for pain management um, if I'm feeling a little down it definitely helps me feel a little bit better uh, after you know on the come down you definitely get some munchies so it helps with that uh, indica dominant so I would say if you have trouble sleeping probably help you go to sleep uh, very chill very nice very mellow uh, very just enjoyable there's not not much bad to say about coffee ice cream and now that it's live live for 65 I would say I would say game over honestly like this is this should be this is where the this is where everybody should be at as far as price as far as quality like this is where the market needs to be this is where the market like the value just all that so that being said uh what else have i been up to let's not make this too short I've been blowing glass. Y'all know I make dabbers. Y'all know I make pipes. Well, lately I've been making these little guys. Make these little glass cups for Q-tips. Made a bunch of them. It's coil pot method. It's where you take a solid rod of glass and turn it into a vessel. These aren't made with an already formed piece of tube. This is all hand formed, but these have been my new little project. Still cranking out bowl pieces, still cranking out dabbers, but these are the newest, the newest product in the glass line. Um, few people have them actually. I actually mailed out a couple this week. So Scott, got hooked up with one drew picked one up um they both actually also got 
nice little uh, spoon pipes so hopefully see those guys posting on Instagram soon and hopefully they like what they got um, but yeah that's what I've been up to not sweating it out in the third floor studio <laughs> hanging out with the dog and blowing glass and doing work so you know what it is um, there's a bunch of new stuff there's a bunch of new stuff I know there's a bunch of newer stuff coming to the market because I've been talking to some people so there's definitely going to be more videos uh, we'll figure out the, the giveaways uh, somebody actually told me recently that they think giveaways are lame and that giveaways are definitely not why they watch my videos they watch my videos because my videos are helpful and giveaways are gimmicky and he said that he felt like the giveaway is kind of an unnecessary addition to the channel and that the channels the way it is is perfect it's educational it helps people and it's not full of fluffy crap I'm not trying to sell you guys on a bunch of stuff usually um, even though I make stuff I I don't really push it on the channel so homie said that the giveaways kind of watered watered it down so we're gonna figure it out but maybe y'all don't really care about the giveaways and we shouldn't do them maybe I should just throw away the giveaways because it doesn't seem like a lot of engagement's happening so we'll see we'll see about the giveaways uh i i like giving people stuff like especially stuff i make the glass and stuff i really want to give it to y'all so we'll figure out a way to make it work but if you're not a subscriber hit that sub button hit that thumbs up if you like the videos and go check out the dab x full review if you haven't already, and I will see you in the next one. Peace.